بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو ڈے سیشن آن مائکروسافٹ میل مرچ ٹو ڈے ول ٹرائی ٹو کور اٹ فسٹ ول ڈسکس دا یوزیج اینڈ بینیفٹس آف اٹ اینڈ دین ول ڈو اے ڈیمو آف اٹ سو یو ول ہیو اے بیٹر انڈرسٹینڈنگ ہاؤ ٹو یوز دس فیوچر دا یوز آف میل مرج از ٹو جنریٹ bulk emails uh, print bulk letters uh, it can use to print labels uh, letters addresses on envelopes directory uh, it's just like, uh, like a kind of phone directory right okay uh, few examples of uh, bulk emails or letters could be uh, sales commission distribution uh, promotion letters marketing letters customer balances letters annual bonus letters increment letters invitation letters emails etc now it is up to you uh, what is your use the only thing is uh, you should have data in excel if not excel if you have a csv file you can import in the excel so then you can use this feature okay how it works so let's say for example you have data uh, in excel uh, details or uh, sales or employees or whatever information uh, <coughs> then you can link this to a uh, word template you will create a template here so you will f- it will link this uh, f- uh, letter or file to this data and it will fetch information uh, one by one and then you can decide you want to send an email or you want to print letters uh, through printer okay at the same time let's say for example if you have uh, contacts in your address book of outlook so you can link this and you can print some letters or whatever i mean it is up to you if you have emails over here you can link and then you can decide you want to send email or print print or whatever so right so this is the complete process of mail match okay let's have few uh, limitations before proceeding to uh, our demo it can send email to a single email right so it will not support comma so let's say for example one letter will go to one email single email there is no comma or semicolon or whatever this is the limitation okay <coughs> but if you have uh, to send same letter to multiple then maybe you have to add uh, uh, multiple times you can send this letters there can be work around but one email will go to one i will show you how where this uh, limitation is okay same subject because subject is uh, will be same for all email addresses so you can't pass subject as a parameter or values so it will remain same for all all emails right because subject will be on the emails not on the printing uh, once excel file attached so once you attach the file uh, to microsoft word then uh, it is uh, in a read only mode you can't change it so whatever values you have to update you update that then open the word in order to fetch the information right each excel data row will generate one email or one page so whatever in one row it will be considered as a one letter or one email right so you can't say you if your data is on two rows you want to send to one email no so each each row is one email okay let's have some demo okay uh, using our bulk uh, data generator tool i have generated some data sample data it's just sample for the demo purpose uh, where it has order number so let's say i just uh, took uh, maybe i think 1000 right 1000 records okay it's just for demo i'm just trying to show you this data is uh, not actual data so let's say for example you have calculated this commission right this is per order commission not per sales person which you can do up to you i'm just wanted to show uh, wanted to show you uh, more number of letters so that's why i'm just sending one letter for each order right 
another way is i should calculate uh, commission for sales person so then it will be maybe uh, four or five letters so because there are sales person only four or five so it will not make you you know feel that okay what is the use of mail merge i can write five letters why you are using mail merge so i'm just putting it order wise because since i have this sample data so here i have the amount and then i then i calculated uh, commission just 10% and this is uh, email i just generated email what i did i concatenated with this sales person name that's it nothing just sample data okay then i just put some just uh, with the concatenation just added some address just to show you how we will pick this information right okay now this data is there then i have a letter sample letter just if you see here it has some header i just took one template of word and then just put it some logo and this and that and then if you see here here i will put it uh, recipient name then here i will put the address and then see here i have calculated at 10% then here i will put order number region this 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 warm letter and whatever i mean this you can add more information as well this is just uh, uh, for your uh, demo purpose okay <clears throat> then now what we'll do i will open this word document you can close this uh, file so it shouldn't be in a read only mode okay mail mark right okay now go to mailing now the here there are two steps one is uh, if you see here one is step by step mail merge wizard it is wizard based so it will guide you okay do this do this do this do this you can try but i will share with you the manual process you will know the concepts right so here you have letters you have email messages you have envelopes you have labels direct free normal okay what i will do first let us go with email messages because uh, then you will see this uh, email limitations as well right so okay i will click this one email messages right so now there is a template over here this one now i have to attach the recipient which is my excel file right so uh, here you can see outlook contacts but i am not going to use outlook contact because i don't have so what i'm going to do i will use uh, an existing list okay here i have to select now that uh, file which i believe is uh, m a i l mail merge this one right i will click open so it is asking me which sheet you are uh, is there so i am selecting this sheet here this will be clicked so first row of data contains column headers it's okay right because first is the headings okay now there is no error there is nothing that means that file is attached with this document now i have to fetch those uh information that information into this okay let's say for example first i will take the recipient name let me remove this and here i will put here insert mail merge field so what i need over here sales person right okay you can have a live view as well you can just click preview results it will show you whatever is there right so let us use this one so then i will take this address it's a sample template so i will add address over here address right this is the first uh, uh, sales person or first order information so here i will not change anything because here i am putting this name so this is okay now let us go down here if you see here i don't need any field over here so here i will put order number so here is the order number which was one region i will fetch region over here then i will this is just i added sample some fields is there nothing hard and fast uh, now i have to take product right okay uh, product i want to category so you can, if you want you can take it okay quantity right okay then i have to take price i am just giving some evidences that you are calculation so he can he or she can calculate as well it's uh, just an evidence okay amount so this is the amount and the commission 
will be here right okay let us put it down okay just to show you uh, let me put it here email address as well so here I will get the email right so if you see here since I concluded correct email is coming right okay right okay now let's say for example this is the first salesperson or record you can move between the records in order to verify see here if I'm going moving next it is showing me the relevant data of each order or salesperson right if you see order number is also changing everything is changing right okay let me come back you can find recipient you can find the letter immediately whatever I mean there are different other fields address blocks and it will help you you can select by default I will not complicate things uh, so let's say our uh, letter is generated so let me proceed with this one so last stage is the finish finish and merge right now here again you have options if you will click this one what it will it will it will do it will not send letters uh, it will only generate letters so 1000 pages so if you want to change individually or whatever you want to print whatever up to you but instead and this is print documents if you want to print the next one is send email messages I will click this one okay here is that limitation which I was talking about so okay to email right see here so in the two my field was email right where I have the email address subject so here the subject is same for all uh, email messages uh, demo mail merge right okay another thing is uh, Microsoft Word don't have any internal or built-in uh, email client right so it will use your local client whatever is configured and is a default let's say for example if it is Outlook it will use your Outlook right so let's say for example you have format this okay and demo mail will be the subject okay if I will click OK it will take my local profile of the outlook and it will send individual 1000 emails on the emails provided under email column of the excel file right so I will not click now okay let me click cancel so this is how to send the email I will I will cancel it now let us try I will say edit individual document see I can put it from to let me put it 1 to 10 I don't want to generate 1000 okay 1 to 10 okay right if you see here now these are 10 pages see even you can print from here up to you if you want to manually check you want to make some changes up to you but Microsoft Word has generated 10 pages right this is how you can use it and uh, send emails or print or whatever you want to do it now then you can have envelopes so if you have addresses you can print uh, addresses on the envelopes if you have some labels um, product labels or any any sort of labels or for the CDs or DVDs see here it is mentioned so you can even use that as well right so this is how uh, a mail merge can be used in your uh, printing letters or whatever you want to do uh, let me go through this anything is pending no and thank you very much share your feedback if you like the feature and if you tried it you faced any challenge please uh, ask uh, your question I hope so it is very straightforward simple and I've tried to explain it very simple as well so all required is practicing it if you will practicing practice it you will save a lot of time believe me I've helped different users and they had to do manual things so through mail merge it was I mean maybe days job you can do within few minutes right 
थैंक यू वेरी मच एंड अल्लाह हाफिज़